Hello everybody, I'm Marty Whitney with Artitude Adjustment. I teach fun art, not fine art. And I'd like, if you like painting, then you'd probably like to stay here for just a few minutes. Uh, this isn't usually the time that I start painting. I usually come on at three o'clock every day. Um, and that's Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. Uh, I'm going to check a cue that I'm getting from Facebook so that I can see your comments. So, it should come up any moment. Here it is. I just don't want to miss what you're saying. I'm in the activities room of Florida Grand Motor Coach Associate, oh, Florida Grand Motor Coach Resort, and I'm, uh, so somebody might come in here. But it's okay. But today I'm trying to finish the guitar that we started about two weeks ago. I am on the final touches and that's why I thought you might like to see it. Friday, which is usually a day that I am um, doing a live, I was uh, presenting a, a painting class at uh, Fleetwood Motor Coach Association Rally at Lazy Days in Tampa, Florida. It was a lot of fun, a lot of ladies. It was a sold out class. And uh, we, we, um, we did lighted, uh, blue cobalt lighted bottles with the cork in the top and all decorated. There was, they were very happy with the outcome. Hey Rhonda, glad you're here. And I appreciate you saying hello when you come in so that I can see who's coming in. Um, like I said, I won't be at my live today my husband reminded me this morning, he has an eye doctor appointment uh, in Wesley Chapel, which is about an hour south of here. Lekka, I'm so glad you came. I, I just didn't know how to uh, say um, I'm not going to be on at three today, but maybe uh, you would catch the replay of this. So let me know if you do catch the replay. Hello there. Hello to everybody. But I've had such a good time painting this guitar. And it's gonna, I'm gonna, so I'm gonna show it to you. And then we're gonna go picture in a picture. I'm doing a final, remember that it, it was a red? Uh, hey Sandy, oh I'm glad you're gonna get to see the finished guitar too. Um, remember it was a red lacquered china guitar? Well, it is no longer a red lacquered china guitar. And I've enjoyed uh, painting it and it's uh, kind of crazy. So I want to know what you think of it. Um, because, you know, I ha from here, whenever the, uh, when the guitar is completed, I have a concert that I give uh, to the herd of cows. Uh, actually, they're star cows. They're black Angus uh, cows uh, in back of my yard uh, at Florida Grand. So you can see that I've just taken a lot of pains to make it beautiful for them. It kind of goes along with the trumpet that I just finished. Now I'm gonna to try to turn it over. I've completed the sides in kind of a wood grain, but the back, I'll show you that a little bit later. We're gonna be finishing the front. And this is the, remember the, remember the frets and the dials and all that stuff? Hey, oh, thanks, Rhonda, I appreciate it. Yeah, there's people coming in right now. So anyway, um, if they do come in, I just act real friendly to them because they're real nice people. Okay, so I am going to put my picture. Um, they're just looking at me in the window right now. They're definitely welcome to come in. I probably look like um, a little nerdy okay so we're gonna just be putting i use something called triple thick whenever i'm completing something like this that doesn't mean that i won't come by and spray something on it later but this should do it this should be all i need <laughs> do you think toby will like it sandy um toby and the toby's the horse and then there's the cows so um uh, the cows and the horses love concerts whenever I give it to them. And uh, they definitely, uh, if you saw the video that I had, uh, uh, the, 
video um, was definitely received very well by the cow, by the by cows, and especially Toby. So I'm just going to start putting some of this um, on the guitar. I was really hoping we could get some of this done today before I had to leave for my appointment. Triple Thick goes on very well. It's water-based, and uh, I did so I can just rinse it out with soap and water after I'm finished. And there isn't there is a little bit of um, uh, odor, a little bit, not as much as you would find if you were uh, using uh, a lacquer or uh, a, another type of finish. And that's one other reason why I prefer um, triple thick. They also make the can. <laughs> that's funny, Sandy. He is. Bessie is just such a sweet cow. Uh, these cows. Um, Toby comes up to our place every day um, for his treat that my husband always has. Um, now, he would take the seeds out of it if I'd let him, but because he's so, so uh, considerate of Toby. But he always cuts an apple or two apples up into pieces and... We feed him over the fence, and then he also gets peppermints, sometimes carrots, but it's mostly apple and peppermints because we definitely want him to have, <laughs> we definitely want him to have good breath, good hygiene, horse with good hygiene. Yes, I did paint the strings. It won't matter in my concert. Uh, like I said, I'm I'm just going to have to kind of monitor this and see if I need to uh, spray another coat of paint on this. I hope you've enjoyed um, painting the guitar with me. I think it's been a lot of fun. And you remember the trumpet that we did? Lots of fun. Um, and if you follow me and my page on Artitude Adjustment, you know that I do Facebook Lives Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays at 3 p.m. Um, this is, see if we need to make these a little glossier. Okay, now I'm going to turn the guitar around, make sure that I have everything painted. <laughs> oh, you'll see it, Leka. You'll see it. I just haven't decided um, what particular song I want to play, like Move Over, Beethoven. And I can only tell from the reflection here that there are areas that I need just a little bit of attention. This is giving it a real high gloss, so, and that's exactly what I wanted. You may not, because it's going to also be a decor item. Uh, this will probably use, oh, I've got to find a, um, I have to find a guitar strap so when I play, um, I can support it well. You see, this is showing that the side is painted kind of a woody grain. My version of woody grain. So, um, hope you had a good weekend. We had a really busy weekend, and that's another reason why I wanted to take care of showing you the finished guitar before the afternoon gets here. Um, do you remember the parts that I showed you? Uh, remember
remember, these are the frets and the tuners. Greta, oh my gosh, it's so good to see you. Everybody say hello to Greta. Haven't seen you in a while. I know you're busy though. Busy, 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 busy. We really miss you, Greta. So I'm glad you were able to be on here this morning. I probably won't be on a long time uh, because I don't have that much to do on this project today. So if you're here, you are looking at me finishing up what was a Chinese red lacquered guitar is about as red as a firecracker. And we just wanted it to look more appropriate. Uh, I will have to do the back, but I'm gonna let this dry first. Now, I could, I haven't decided yet, but I could go back and, which reminds me, I hope you will excuse me, I don't have on my microphone. Can you hear me okay? I, me and that microphone. It's just that it would be a lot crisper if I had it on. Greta, lots of people here right now. Um, I know you've been busy playing with all those grandkids and getting settled. That takes a while. Okay, I'm just trying not to leave any puddles in here of triple thick. I'm so glad you're here, and I appreciate you being here this morning. Uh, Monday mornings are usually busy around here. Uh, I'll have to probably get some of this varnish off of the strings. So anyway, so if you're used to doing, uh, being here for my live on Monday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. I will be back on Wednesday and we're going to do the other side of the guitar at that time. Just trying to see that this isn't puddling and we're catching all the spots. So easy to work with triple thick. Now, okay, everybody, if you have any questions or comments, I appreciate them. I um, am Marty Whitney with Artitude Adjustment, and I teach uh, fun art, not fine art, and I teach at RV rallies all over the country, as well as Florida Grand Motor Coach Resort in Webster, Florida. My husband and I are full-time RVers, and we've been doing that, if you can believe this, for 12 years, yes, and uh, we've really enjoyed it. It's been a blessing to us, and we meet lots and lots of of nice people um, in this experience. And uh, I 
I'd like to thank you for being here today. We will see you again on Wednesday at 3 p.m. where I'll be doing a live. And uh, if you have a chance, I would hope that you would uh, S-H-A-R-E. I can't say the word. But uh, if not, please subscribe to Artitude Adjustment. Thank you so much. It's a great day to have a great day. Y'all go do something real nice for yourselves and then do something real nice for somebody else. Uh, like I said, if you have any comments or questions, I'd appreciate you letting me know. Y'all, uh, uh, forgot what I was going to say. Anyway, have a great day. And uh, I'll be seeing you soon, probably tomorrow, uh, Wednesday. <laughs>